That was kind of quiet. At least I think so, you know? Alright. Hello, everyone. Montez here! Playing, playing, still remember this, Adventure Time, Investigations with Finn and Jake. Or was it Finn and Jake Investigations? You know, I don't. Alright, so. All the graphics just loaded. You can mess with the balloons. Sure is gonna take a long time to open all of those. Think anybody noticed if one or two went missing? <laughs> nah, better not. Don't, don't. Sure is gonna take a long time to open all of those. Okay, you're just going to say the same thing, aren't you? Tape! Are you scotch? That shield is as big as a nice sized cake! Oh, no, sorry, I tend to describe things in terms of food when I'm hungry. Should we take it? I don't need a shield now, but I'll find a use for it. So, you took it. <laughs> Didn't need to take it, but you still took it. Kind of a weird selection of weapons. A hammer and a sword. Sure is gonna take a long time to open all of those. Yeah. Wow, that's a lot of gifts. Wonder if they're all for the coronation. You gonna say the same thing? Everything's here. All presents and accounted for. Get it? Is there... Uh, never mind. No puns. We don't accept puns in here. Get the lump out of here! Uh. Lumpy Space Princess, we need to talk to you about your three noble deeds. Yeah, whatever. I totally nailed those. Tell us about the lovely Tell us party. About the Marshmallow Kid's birthday party. Okay, so I was supposed to bake him cake, but like baking is really hard and you need ingredients and stuff, and I was super busy. So I just jammed together some candy people and stuff I found on the ground and made a cake. It was awesome! Oh my god. That's not awesome, LSP. That's horrible. He's just a stupid kid. It's not like he'll notice. It's not like you can do any better. The lovelorn couple. Tell us about helping Nurse Poundcake and Dr. Donut. Yeah, the donut doctor guy? He gave me this sad, pathetic note full of mushy stuff, and he wanted me to give it to her and stuff. But I'm a lady, and I just know that the cake nurse doesn't want a whiny guy like that all up in her lungs. Not delivering that note was the best help I could give her. But what happened to the note? I don't know! I grabbed a snack in the kitchen and left, and oh my god, do you expect me to remember everything? Jeez. This is my big day! I have stuff on my mind, Ben! Then the friend in need. So what about doing a favor for a friend? How'd you nail that one? That one was super easy. Wolves are complicated, so I just totally decided to outsource it. There's a bunch of people with nothing to do down near the tavern. One of those guys said he'd walk the cinnamon guy's wolf. You gave cinnamon buns back to some bum? I'm not stupid, Jake. I didn't give him to a bum. I lent him to a bum. And he said he's totally gonna take the wolf back to cinnamon bun when he's done walking him. Totally. That told me enough. Alright, LSP. That's it for now. But we might be back later, so stay here. Yeah, bye. Whatever. What? Jeez. Sorry, guys. I really can't help you. There's a great view of the Candy Kingdom from here. Wish I could see it. Pretty standard door. Everybody's got them. Can't open it. It's locked. 
Pretty standard door. Everybody's got them. Excuse me, I burped. Oh, so that was the foyer. Was it? It's one of those spray can things. You can suck up and spray liquid with it. Yep, that must have been the foyer. Jeez. Why did they change the camera angle? Oh man, Cinnamon Bun looks upset. Cinnamon Bun, what's the matter? Oh, Finn, Jake, you gotta help me. Jake too is missing. Jake who? Uh, who's Jake two again? You know, Jake too! I pet Firewolf! I named him after you, Jake, because you and me are such good friends! Oh, yeah! <laughs> oh, what man? happened? What happened to him? Well, Funky Space Princess was supposed to take him for a walk while I was getting ready for the coronation thing. But she gave him to some stranger to do it for her. She said wolves are complicated, but I think she's just lazy and mean. Jake, unless P really messed this up, Filament Butler needs to know about this, but not until we help Cinnamon Bun. How can we help Cinnamon Bun? You guys have got to find Jake, too, and bring him back to me. He's going to be scared all alone. Fire will start burning stuff when they're scared. Don't worry, man. We'll bring him back safe and sound. Okay. Fireworks. Candy rocket. Cool. Too bad it's missing a fuse. Can I check it? I took it. Took one, I guess. What is that? That cake is so nasty, I think I might hurl. Mr. Cream Puff looks upset. Finn and Drake, just look at that horrible cake LSP made for the party. We need a new one. Yes, I'm pretty sure you don't want to eat that. That marshmallow kid is really sad. We should find out what's wrong. Finn! Jake! My birthday party is ruined! What happened? What happened? Why are you so upset? One of Lumpy Space Princess's noble deeds was to throw me a great birthday party! She totally dunked it up. And then what's up with the cake? Um, what happened to that cake? It was awful! LSP brought a homemade cake, but she made it out of garbage! And candy people! It attacked my friends! The banana guards had to knock it unconscious! Oh my god! Cake! When Filament Butler hears how bad LSP screwed this thing up, he'll have to reconsider putting her in charge of the Ice Kingdom! An Amalagite or something? But first, we gotta do something to help this poor kid. And I said, Anne. We don't How can we help? Lousy birthday party, Marshmallow Kid. What can we do to fix it? Well, if it wouldn't be too much trouble, could you guys make me a new cake, a better one, one that isn't, you know, alive or mixed you with got it, something? Kid. Me and Jake will make you the best birthday cake we've ever made. Mixed with both monsters and people. So it'll maybe be good, but we can promise that it won't be alive. Probably. All right, Jake. We're gonna need a cake plate, a cake, some frosting, <gasps> and some cool bling to top it all off. Let's get started. Four things. Uh, probably two can be taken away. Don't stick your hand in the punch, man. It's rude. That's some tasty looking punch. That is super sugary. Punch it. Punch it. It's an abomination. No, nah, I don't think so. What do I need? We can build a new cake right here. First thing we'll need is a cake plate. Oh. There! 
That'll make a good cake plate. Now for the cake. Alright, one. This is gonna be an awesome party. Okay. <laughs> snail. Snail. Check it out. Snail. It's gone. Excuse me, I burped because I just drank soda. Oh, excuse me. Who else doesn't want to hear that? Dang, son. It's a big feather. Good for tickling people. And flying, I guess, if you're a bird. Feather. I don't think anybody lives here. Nobody I'd want to meet anyway. <laughs> It'd be cool to have a cupcake house. I bet we could rent this one cheap. Oh, it says chocolate. What are you? Hmm, never seen that guy around before. Guess what are you? Hey, what's up? You must be new around here. Hey, yeah, me, Sonny. Hi, Sonny. We're Finn and Jake, adventurers and investigators. Nice to meet you. Yeah, same here. Later. Yeah, see ya. Say hello to the new character, new. Finn, Jake. Finn, Jake. Sonny seems nice enough. Doesn't talk much. Yeah, good point. Digging around in trash cans isn't my idea of fun. Not that I don't do it from time to time. <laughs> Wonder why somebody'd leave a perfectly good soap on the street. Good point. Take it. I don't think anybody lives here. Nobody I'd want to meet anyway. The guy who always like is so mad that he looks like he's gonna crap his that own pants. That rope would make a great belt or a fuse even. Take it. Hey, hands off! That's mine. What? Let's talk to Cookie Guy. I have a feeling he can help us out. Cookie Guy. Cookie. You got about two seconds before I punch you in the face. Punch you in the face. Yeah. Hi. Ah. Fuck you in the face! So, what brings you to this lovely part of town Punch. today? Punch! Not that it's any of your business, but I'm waiting for the cavern to open. I need me a nice sugary beverage! Beverage ass! So, what you got over there? Rope or something? Yeah! It's my new rope belt! Just got it! What? Can we have the rope? Sure would like to have a belt that nice. What do you want for it? It ain't for sale! But if you want a trade, you can give me a sugary drink. Cola, punch, whatever! I'd give anything for a sugary drink. Man, I am an angry, angry cookie! Ah! So I guess that's how the cookie crumbles, huh? Digging around in trash cans isn't my idea of fun. Not that I don't do it from time to time. Not that I would like to skip that. Ooh, fire. That won't work. Fire. Keep him warm. And burning and lighting stuff. Zeus! Not gonna work. Okay. You can't light that until it has a fuse. Uh. Ooh, locked. And it's made of tempered licorice steel. Sounds like Dr. J and J2 are behind that door. Who's Dr. J? Man, Dr. This ain't even a sugar cone! <sighs> nice firewolf! Heal! If somebody can hear me! How do I get into these situations? 
Note to self, never get a pet. Whoa. Nice doggy. Who's a good boy? Girl? Thing? Now to stay calm. You wouldn't hurt me, would ya? Man, this ain't even a sugar cone. Sugar cone. Well, I heard enough. Nice firewall. Dude, you don't know where that junk's been. Somebody took the wheels. Sheesh, this is a bad part of town. Go get the bricks. Note to self, never get a pet. Never get a pet. Never get a pair. Never get a pair. Can I talk to you even more? Hey, Jake. Okay, no. Can't talk to Sunny. That cake is so nasty, I think I might hurl. Oh! Now we can take the punch the cookie guy. No. Spray can of punch. A truly unconventional way to carry and, distri and distribute a sugary drink. Handlebars, there's nothing they can't handle? Oh my god. Feather, good things birds don't have ticklish noses or they might be sneezing all the time. They're covered with these things. Candy rocket, candy kingdom fireworks. Be useless without a fuse. Hmm. This will be a great decorative accessory with just about anywhere. Okay. Here you go. Open wide! What the fuck? <laughs> something over here. Oh, uh, never mind. There isn't. I thought that was like something else. Well, now I got the rope belt. Cookie guy doesn't even wear pants. Why did he need a belt? This looks more like a fuse than a belt anyway. Okay. No, I don't want to mix those two. Oh, I could just click on the same item and then hit Y again to erase that item from being mixed, you know? Candy, rocket, and mix. Ah, oh, yeah! Nice view! Now we can light this thing! Candy, rocket, and fuse. Now that it has a fuse, all we need is some fire and boom! Yeah, let's do this, you know? Okay, the fuse is lit and it's gonna explode soonish. Now what? Candy, rocket. Quote unquote. Ah, not quote unquote. In parentheses, it says lit. Holding on to lit fireworks. Adventure time indeed. We're gonna explode it. Now just stand back and watch the fireworks. Nice! Cool. Nice, doggy. Who's a good boy? Girl? Thing? Mario keeps sneezing. Jeez, never thought I'd be glad to see you guys. Uh, having a problem, Dr. J? Of course I am. I want this firewolf just like the lumpy broad told me, but that didn't tire him out. So I brought him down here and started playing fetch with a broom. Now he wants me to keep playing and I can't get rid of him. He'll burn the whole place down if I don't get him out of here. Firewolves do love playing fetch. Well, find him something more interesting to fetch so he'll leave me alone. We should help him. Hey, we can figure out something more in- Whoops. Interesting for Jake 2 to fetch. He'll probably follow us back to Cinnamon Bun. Okay, cool. He 
something so big. You gotta wonder whether it's a good idea to have a firewolf for a pet. Here, Jake, too. Here, boy. Nah, nothing. I don't think so. A jewel is not a chew toy. Maybe something more stick like. Hey, do you see that skeleton? If only it had a hoodie. Hey, Jake, too. Check this out. What? A feather? You're gonna throw a feather? <laughs> Good boy. Okay, Jake. Let's get Jake 2 back to Cinnamon Bun. Hey, Cinnamon Bun. Look who we found. Jake 2! Kid, Jake, thank you for finding my firewall. That's what I get for trusting Lumpy Space Princess. She's irresponsible. Cool. She's an irresponsible yeah. team. Jeez. Well, cool. I figured that problem out. So now what? I'm sure glad we can help him find his firewolf. Same. Wait, there's something I can do over there. Why would I do that? Balloons? That's it! Take it. Don't steal the balloons, dude! Uh... Same. Sonny might be in character development, development, or she's already, or he, I don't know. Uh, you know, created, or I probably haven't even noticed. But whatever, I'm going to try to find something else. That's not working. Fire. Keep him warm. And burning and lighting stuff. Can I burn myself? Hot. Ah. Maybe there's... No, I can't go back down there. So what now? Do I tell somebody about it? Do I go and gloat? Do I go and gloat? Can I take the couch? Can I do anything? Nobody came. Dude, references. this smells like a classic lumpy space princess screw up. We gotta tell Philemon Butler. What are you doing, This Mario? could be the thing that keeps LRP from taking over the Ice Kingdom. Yeah, but we gotta fix things between Nurse Poundcake and Dr. Donut. First. Mario! Mario's just sniffing his egg loop. I'm sure things are fine, Nurse P. What can we do to reassure you? I won't be satisfied until I see Dr. Donut's note. If you find it, Although, everything is fine between us. No problem. Me and Jake will find that note. So I guess I gotta give her the note. When I find it, that is. Can I go into rooms? No. A maybe. Squish? If I try to remove it with my hand, I'll tear it apart. Then tear it apart. Hmm. They're repairing the wall. With cake! Take it! Not with your hands, dude! That's food! You need something to pick it up! Use the... Handle? Nah, I don't think so. Shut up, phone. That ain't working, dude. It's Jake. You sword. We could maybe use that cake wall, but not if you're happy to piss. That won't work. Okay, nothing will work. Do 
Dr. Donut. It's Dr. Donut! Man, he looks pretty antsy. Does he have ants in his pants? Finn! Jake! Oh, what a day I'm having. Why didn't you invite Nurse Poundcake to the coronation like you said you would? What? I did invite her. Oh, this is terrible. Hello Mint Butler told me he would have Lumpy Space Princess deliver my invitation note personally. Uh, what could have happened to it? Why so blue, Dr. D? You'd be upset too if you Dr. didn't have Duke. a date for the coronation. Dr. I don't, Dr. Dre. and I'm not, but what if? Just as we suspected. Don't worry, Dr. Donut. Finn and Jake are on the case. We'll get things patched up between you and Nurse Poundcake. Oh, Thank you, Finn. Oh, oh. I sure hope you can clear this up. Finn, Jake, please. Just find the note and deliver it to Nurse Poundcake. Oh, right, I didn't. That door leads out to the hallway. Those doors lead to the royal foyer. Yep, this is the same place, only just different decorations. Think anybody noticed if one or two went missing? <laughs> nah, better not. <laughs> what the? Come on! Admire the view later, Finn. We got stuff to do. They're gone. They're freaking gone! Must be locked. <laughs> Lumpy Space Princess, we need to talk to you about your three noble deeds. Yeah, whatever, I totally nailed those. Well, I already figured this out, but I... What is it? Friend in need? So what about doing a favor for a friend? How'd you nail that one? That one was super easy. Wolves are complicated, so I just totally decided to outsource it. <clears throat> There's a bunch of people with nothing to do down near the tavern. One of those guys said he'd walk the cinnamon guy's wall. You gave cinnamon buns back to some bum? I'm not stupid, Jay. I didn't give him to a bum. I lent him to a bum. And he said he's totally gonna take the wolf back to cinnamon bun when he's done walking him. All right, LSP, that's it for now. But we might be back later, so stay here. Yeah, bye, whatever. Don't make me slap the lumps out of you. Then where's Princess Bubblegum and all that? Where's Pillament Butler? That's enough cotton candy to last, like, a year! Is there 
something else with the cookie? Now you're pushing your luck! Why are you still bothering me? I got nothing else for you! Oh, excuse me, I burped still. It'd be cool to have a cupcake house. I bet we could rent this one cheap. Forget it, dude. Have you seen how many sofas we've got at home? We don't need another one. Yes, you do. Take it. Take it now. Try to find a box. That did exactly nothing. I don't think you're gonna find anything useful in there, dude. Upstairs. Thank you, God. Hands off the science stuff, dude. Science is not your thing. That might be one of the worst ideas you've ever had. PB stove is nicer than ours. Old pizza. Gross. Spatula. That's new. Why would I do that? Can we wash it? It's almost as if they pasted a flat image, but made it HD. Cookbooks! We should exchange recipes with PV sometime. Ooh, use a recipe. It's Dr. Donut's note to Nurse Pound Cake. We gotta deliver it to her. Go, 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 Oh, wait. Dr. 
the donuts. No, the note inviting Nurse Pound King to the coronation that LSP didn't deliver. Spatula, are you for slicing and serving things? Cake, for instance. Oh, yes. So we're going to use spatula here. That could be the base layer for a cake. Nice. Good. Where we got? Why does it look like poop? Wall cake base, a section of candy king. <laughs> this, a section of the candy kingdom wall made out of a cake. Wait a minute. What if we do this and then actually all of the good deeds that we've done to solve everything that LSP did? What if LSP? What if LSP gets all of the rights from all the things that we that I've done? Because that has happened in my days. Nurse Pound Cake, look what we found. Being nice and then it, you know. Problem solved. So, you will now deliver the cake base, I guess, to the cake. The perfect start to a perfect cake. Or at least a better one than LSP's. Okay, so. That's sorta of right, but not quite. Something's missing? Okay, let me keep checking. Maybe I haven't checked something. Oh, he's gone. Hey, the bubble's gone. And the leaves are gone, too. Refrigerator. Wish we had one of those. As I said, they have a deep freezer. Water. A faucet. No uh, safe you can drink without one of these. Oh god! Yeah. Doesn't seem safe to have this stuff around food. Hands off the science stuff, dude. Science is not your thing. Hmm. So now what? Peppermint Butler should get his peppermint butt in here and clean up this nasty pizza. It's disgusting! Uh, oh man, I'm sleepy, but I'm still doing it. I'm still trucking. You still gotta do what you love. Go that direction. End the direction. It's locked. Why is it still locked? Lumpy Space Princess, we need to talk to you about your three noble deeds. No. Yeah, whatever. I totally nailed those. No, you did. All right, LSP. That's it for now. But we might be back later, so stay here. Yeah. Bye. Whatever. This is 
gonna be an awesome party. That's a good kick face. Now it needs some frosting. Frosting? Oh. Where can I get frosting? Or something similar to frosting. junk has been good that'll be a secret that'll be a secret only to me Jake wait you know about it too never mind all right, so where are we going now? Oh. Ben, Jake. Sunny would say I something else. I have a else. feeling we'll be seeing Sunny again. In a later episode? Or something? I don't think Mr. Cream Puff wants me to squeeze it. Why? Do you think Mr. Cream Puff is really full of cream frosting? I don't think you can squeeze the frosting out of him. We'll do it. Nah, I don't think so. Give it up, man. That won't work. I'll have to squeeze your frosting. I could cut the frosting out, but nah. Ah! <laughs> oh! Gross. But oddly tasty looking. At least we have some frosting there. Everywhere. Cake frosting. Freshly sneezed, sneezed cream frosting? Courtesy of Mr. Cream Puff. Bloop. You might think it's frosting, but it's not. <laughs> Almost done, I think. <sighs> there we go. What awesome birthday cake. What do you think, Marshmallow Kid? Pretty nice, huh? Yes! That's way better than that nasty thing LST made. Thanks, Finny Jake. Glad to help. All right, Jake. That's that. We fixed all of LSP's noble deed screw ups. Time to let Pillman Butler know what a bad job she did. Oh, yes. yes. No way he'll put her in charge of the Ice Kingdom after he hears what a mess she made of everything. Yes. Pillman Butler, Jake and me are finally back. And man, oh man, are you going to want to hear about this? Yes. What the? By the what? power vested in me. By the Candy Kingdom and the King of Ooh, I pronounce you Princess of the Ice Kingdom. Oh, oh come God. on! But how? We have evidence. Alice being the complete her noble deeds. Really? Well, my records show that all three of Lovely Space... Excuse me. Ice Kingdom Princess's noble deeds were completed impeccably. What? No! She totally dumped them off! Me and Jake were the ones who completed the deeds and helped our friends! Well, I'm afraid I can't corroborate your story, young man. And at any rate, it's much too late. Are ah, you peace your face, Ben and Jake! <clears throat> yes. Well, if you will come with me, your highness, there is a reception with light refreshments in the courtyard. No lump and wah! I got my own kingdom now, pillow guy! I'm gonna rule it! Lumpy Ice Princess out! Aw, oh, man! I guess we're gonna have Ice King as a permanent roomie. No way, man. This isn't over. Let's give her a day or two and then head up to the Ice Kingdom and look around. All right, but I'm taking the sofa tonight. Ice King snores. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, man. That was so useless. I could have just waited. I could have waited until that happened. 
Frank indeed. And we came right from the coronation. There wouldn't be anything left of the Ice Kingdom if we'd have waited a few days like you wanted. Frank, <laughs> there's LSP. I have got to know how she managed to mess everything up so fast. Spin the stick! Oh my god, I'm so glad you're here! Eh! Glad we're here? The last thing you said to us was in your face, Finn and Jake. Whatever. Are we gonna talk about your hurt feelings all day, or are you gonna listen to my problems? <sighs> <sighs> all right. What's wrong, Ellis? Sorry. Why is this place such a mess? It's these lumpen penguins. They're such little drama queens. Drama queens. I hate that. But you are a drama queen. And they stole my phone, broke my vase, and Drunk stole my phone. I need that stuff to rule my kingdom. Broke a vase. Ah! Took your phone? They took your phone? What's up with that? Okay, so it was Ginty who stole my phone. Ginty? He's probably using it to gossip to Gunthi about Gunther. Gunthi? Gunther is gonna propose to Guntalina even though Gunthi is like, totally in love with Gunther. Huh? What? Aren't you listening, Ben? I need my phone back. How am I supposed to brag to Melissa about how I totally have my own kingdom without my phone? Find your phone. Got it. Okay. Why is a broken vase so important? A broken vase? Or a vase. Is very important. A vase. That's because you don't understand love, Ben. I set up this totally romantic dinner so that Gunther could pop the question to Gundelina. Uh. But stupid Gunther smashed the vase that the roses were in and the whole thing is totally ruined. Well, it's Gunther. Yeah, but how is that? I need a new vase for the roses. Find me a new Lumpen Vaz for the Roses! Ah! Alright! Jeez! Tell us about the stolen key! So, what about the stolen key? Do I have to explain everything? I ate all 20 pizzas we ordered for breakfast this morning, which is totally my right as princess. But Gunder is like, all mad and stuff because he didn't get any, and he took this really important special key from me. Now he won't give it back until he gets some pizza! Another pizza quest! We've got some experience in that department. Yeah, I think we can get your key back. So, if we find all this stuff, we talk about how much you messed up and how Ice King should be put back in charge of the Ice Kingdom? Yeah, whatever. Why are you still here? Get my lump and stuff! Alright everybody, that's it for this episode, so if you enjoyed this one, please like, comment, and subscribe, and, as always, thanks for watching, and have a great day or night, or wherever you are. Bye!